have a look at the lineups then. best equipped for this game this one's a no-brainer it's got to be Lionel Messi in my opinion he's whistle's gone that's a foul picked out just needed a better finish in this game you're always striving to, to gain an advantage or produce a little surprise element to things and the quicker the delivery I think the more chance you have and they should have done better there well the first attempt hasn't quite drawn first blood but they've got a slight edge as are It's Azar. Looks like a good ball through. Cesc Fabregas. Philippe Coutinho. Luis Suarez plays it out to the wing. Comes under pressure and it's come loose. Seems now to be all about width. Well, when you have the personnel to create in wide areas, then they need to see as much of it. It's Asa! Great build-up. It all deserved a better ending. I thought he did so well to exploit the space that was afforded to him then. Deserve more. That was a chance. What a chance. That's a poor kick by the keeper. He's just given it straight back. Looks to slip it through. Moses. And this is Petro. Cesc Fabregas, and oh! David Luiz. And it's Azar. Azar showed plenty of zest in getting to the ball, but couldn't quite sort it out. Chiru Moses who's he going to play in chip through Hazard Ox to play it he's gone for it all oh, the balls come loose time to deliver Conte Moses now it's Hazard has a shot goal and grabbing that opening goal so close to half time too affords them that extra little psychological edge and when it's one of your main men that's doing the damage, it just grows the togetherness and it grows the spirit. Lovely goal, perfect poise to set himself for the strike.
Deadlock. That's the whistle for half time. So there you have it, a close sport half of football, but one that still had its moments and ultimately produced just one goal. A more than decent game up to now. Any opinion you'd like to express on the first half? Chelsea deserve to be ahead and probably should be in front by more considering the amount of chances they've managed. Everything points to more of the same second half and a good solid win. Leading a cagey game here. It's had its moments and it's 1-0 at the break. We're promptly into the second 45 minutes. Chelsea going well here and they're in a good position to kick on and add to their lead. They don't have to overcommit but they can place more emphasis on stretching their advantage without necessarily... The Pedro! And that would have been some goal. Well, the run was really impressive. The finish was depressive, and expectations were not met. It so nearly came off for him, but that's the motivation and enthusiasm he shows and the quality he produces. Poor kick by the keeper, being intercepted. Petro with the ball through. Jordi Alba. Over to the left. Coutinho tries looking up for options on the left. Busquets spreads it wide. Pinged forward, but this is exactly the approach they have to take now, Peter. Well, this isn't the time to talk about risks now, Jim, is it? They just have to hurl everything at it and hope for a break. Well, there's no two ways about it. This is what they have to do. PK. Iniesta. Plays it into the channel. He's in space and looking for options. Coutinho, the shot's on! It's anyone's ball. He'll have a dip! Barcelona simply cannot let their heads drop. They need their big characters now to keep them going. They're actually not getting too tight, which is interesting. No, it's probably... Cautionary, uh, don't dive in, try to pinch it or, or intercept so nobody can get in behind. Steered out wide. Roberto was brushed off the ball there. And he's there to hoof it away. Now it's Philippe Coutinho. Has a swing at it! Iniesta. And it's Rakitic. Rakitic tries lifting it over. And that's that. Terrific contest. It really might have tipped either way. The margins were tiny. Just a goal in it. But that was enough. Yeah, clean sheets and hard grind will help you go places. And they have a resolve that'll envy many. My thanks to Jim. We both wish you a very good evening.